Courtney, we got two minutes to finish this. How much longer you got? Done. This video is sponsored by Internova. That was obviously a dramatic reenactment. So portable batteries can keep you going whether you have access to power or not. It's actually something that we do here often when we're editing remotely. One downside though used to be the size, but the new Internova ETA totally changes that. Before I get to all that though, I do wanna do something I've been doing for a while. It's my favorite part of these videos. Thank you guys for being awesome humans, supporting the channel all of these years. Give you a chance to win $500, open to anyone in the world, let it run for 10 days. Leave a comment down below, let me know what you do with the ETA, tell me a fact about yourself, just leave your social handle in the comments so I can contact you if you win. Also give the video a thumbs up, all the information you need will be in the description. All right, so from like a feature standpoint, you might look at this thing and be like, John, that's a, a small boy. And it might not be giant, but it's not missing anything. And it comes in at just over 200 bucks and you are getting a ton of IO. When I say it's not big, like this is it. I mean, I could do some curls uh, with it, um, but it's, it's small, it's light, it's portable. I mean, if I can do this and like, you know, I'm not the strongest dude in the world. But you're not sacrificing any milliamp hours or IO. So you've got two AC plugs, three USB-A, one PD USB type C. You can get a car port, not that one, this one, uh, and a few DC outputs. So overall, you've got 10 ports uh, for output. Plus right on top, there's even a wireless charger built in so you can set your phone down without sort of having to take up one of those USB ports. So it is a 600 watt, 288 watt hour battery. So think of it this way. Uh, my iPhone 15 Pro Max has a 4,400 milliamp hour battery inside. Using just this ETA battery, I could recharge my phone from dead 17 times. Just so it's like a perspective, so watt hours don't really mean that much either to most people. Even me, I had to look it up what that meant. Uh, and because it is 600 watt capacity, you can power a lot of things ordinarily you would need a wall plug for. So again, for the size and weight and price, it's packing pretty much everything I think that you can hope for. And it's doing it all without sort of making you feel like you're gonna rip your arm out of your socket, but also it's relatively portable. So it's a, it's a big battery. So it's battery got a lot of million batteries. You might wanna check in on it, see how it's doing, see how it's, it's feeling. Uh, to do that, there's a screen. that gives you all the information that you need. Uh, there are buttons above it to control different parts of the battery, like the AC ports and wireless charger, uh, if that's what you're looking for. Also, if that wasn't enough, for like a game show host, but there's more. There are two lights uh, built in. There's one up front to light up a larger area. And it's also a flashlight built into the side, so you can carry it like a big old lantern. Uh, for the size of this battery, it's really impressive how much is packed in. Uh, but most importantly, obviously, is what this thing can charge and for how long. So one of the best parts about a battery like the ETA is you know your investment is going to last a very long time. And that is due to the lithium iron phosphate batteries inside, which I will call LifePo. And also compared to like normal batteries, these are also way safer. They handle thermal changes better and have a higher thermal limit. So heat to extreme cold or going in between those, these are going to be safe. And because of this, these batteries last six times longer, giving you a 3000 plus charge cycles. And again, perspective with the price, that is a gigantic bang for the buck. And it means you don't have to worry about charging your battery again and again and again. So obviously at some point you're gonna have to charge this. The easiest way is just to you know, plug it in. If you're in a rush, it should go to 80% too in about an hour, which is pretty fast. Uh, but if you're on the go, Enernova also offers solar panels that you can use to charge up to 240 watts. So if you're out somewhere without a plug, as long as you've got the sun, you are good to go. Those panels themselves are IP68, so they're you know, relatively water resistant. Also really durable, so if you do take this on the go, you just wanna use the sun, you're gonna be fine. So obviously it's good for camping or van life or just going out for a weekend. But also if you live in an area where there's often a lot of power outages, you wanna keep it at home and just something that can power your things until power comes on, it's really good for that. Keep it in an office, keep it in your house, keep it in your garage, because it lithium iron phosphate technology, you don't have to worry about the temperature fluctuations. I guarantee you can find a use case that could use this. And for a really affordable price, it probably deserves a spot in everybody's car, truck, home, office, or garage. Personal use case though, oftentimes we are shooting outside of the studio and we've got, obviously you can see a lot of gear. Um, this is all we need to go on the go and to shoot. It can power lights, it can power camera, it can power prompter, it can power monitor, uh, it can power microphone. 
it's gonna be great to like, you know, charge your phone or power an electric kettle while you guys are out camping. A ton of juice, a ton of options. What I like about this too, is you don't have to sort of customize what you're doing to suit the battery pack. It's got so many options to charge, it'll just do whatever uh, you need to do, which is really nice to have. If you wanna check it out or get one for yourself, put a link down below. Also, there's a code to give you 5% off uh, at checkout.